Hi everybody! Okay, so I'm just gonna show you um, the the client uh, request for us to do a customized or personalized scrapbook album that he will be giving us a gift. So um, with this, this is actually a simple story binder um, as you can see inside. And then what we did to make sure that it's very customized on how he wanted to um, have it would be to ask for the colors and for us all of their interests. So this is what we came up with. Um, initially, this is just a, a, like a brown cover um, on the front. And then um, I just uh, created another cover on top of it which is this is the simple stories um two by or double-sided paper that i use this is actually the back of this paper and this is the other side so um that's why i used it it's it's very nice so all of these papers and this binder i actually got it from the crafters marketplace and this is stamp as well so they all came from the January uh, subscription kit of the Crafters Marketplace or TCM. Here you can see that I'm actually, uh, this these hearts are the ones that are very used and some of the text as well. I use them um, to design some of the pages inside of this scrapbook album. There are other stamps in here which are all Heidi Swap stamps. I love her stamps. These are the ones that I use to decorate some of the pages as well. This one, you will see the car. Um, I used it and I think I stamped uh, this and the joy. I'm not sure if you can see it. The joy um, text. Uh, at, this is uh, one of the Christmas um, stamp collection that she has. But as you can see, what I love about her stamps is it's, it's very individual. So you can use it any time of the year. I also used most of uh, this this one I used this amazing um, I think choose happy make it happen etc so I also use this to decorate the pages um, this one I really love because these are all like um, dictionary words as you can see here I use the adore captivate um, sweet yeah those are the ones that I used for here I wanted it to just like simply have um, you know a different feel on how you decorate your scrapbook album I think I use some of this as well and some of the words in here as well so all of these are Heidi swap stamps <clears throat> I was able to get it um, through uh, shine as well from TCM she subscribed on it and I was part of her subscription so yeah so if you wanted to have a subscription kit every month I just send China Sunshine of PCM um, and she can give you all of the options that you have she also has an every other month stamp club kit which is this one you can also get it from her this is really cool this is from honey okay so let me just show you this is scrapbook album so here this is the front. I use Cricut to design this um, a 3D title page. And then this is actually a pet washi tape from Oh My Goodies. And um, the binder is from TCM. And this is actually part of the January sub subscription kit from TCM. I cut it to make my own ephemera. Okay, and this is the back. There you go. <clears throat> Let's open it up. So the first divider, um, I just put in uh, a design paper as well from the subscription kit. I cut this and put in the tabs <clears throat> for this one. Um, this is what I, always, I usually use to make my journal. So hopefully you have this tab maker, a tab puncher, so that it would be easier for you to make this. Okay. And then I designed this using some of the ephemera um, and this is actually part of the 12 by 12 papers that I cut. So it's, a, it's like a pre-printed, uh, pre-cut uh, 12 by 12 paper design with a tag. 
And I also put in this um, glittery cloth star just to add some, you know, funky design on it. <coughs> so he wanted to have a separate uh, page just so he can write his own letter. So here, this is for him. And then I also have this pull out. You can see I and you. And when you pull it out, it says, I really, really like you. Then you just have to push it a little to bring it back. Okay, and this are this is actually a pet washi tape as well from Oh My Goodies. I really love it. It's like a postage stamp. And these are some of the ephemeras from the subscription kit as well. Here, um, I put in all of their photos inside of um, <clears throat> uh, a vellum so that there's like a little mystery on it. And plus the fact that um, it actually gives me value to make sure that their privacy are kept on this video. <laughs> This is a waterfall one. You just have to pull this. And then this, this. I also incorporated some of their <coughs> um, uh, sweet uh, sweet words for each other. And these are the ones that I showed you earlier from the Heidi, Heidi Swap Stamp. See? I really love it. So the next page. There. <coughs> These are also from the ephemera and the stamp and some of the, you know, um, thick, thick board stickers, I believe. <clears throat> this, these hearts are actually stamped that I've shown you earlier from Lawn Fawn. There, I stamped it with the vellum and it's really great. <laughs> okay, so this one, it's funny because, um, do you know the puncher, the small puncher? So you know the puncher that you use, you have these two heads, right? So this one is a little bit small and then um, you will be able to keep some of those trash inside in here. So what I did is I don't actually throw them. <laughs> I keep them so that I can use them to design those. Those are your scraps that you can reuse to design your scrapbook. <clears throat> and these are the shaker, these are actually a shaker. Um, chunky sequins or chunky glitters rather that are stars these are the ones that I use <clears throat> there you go you can see some of the pet washi tapes in here again and most of them are ephemeras this one we printed and this these are actually stamps as well from Ami Tangerine these are sentiment stamps this is really cute. The next would be this. So, ephemeras. I also stamped again in the vellum. And then, these are the stamps from the Heidi Spot collection. Um, same goes for here. So, some of the backgrounds that you can see here, it's also from the January sub kit of TCM. I really love this paper. And here, this is a thick board. We printed this. These are ephemeras. These are ephemeras as well. And this is actually a pocket. And then um, you can see that I've inserted two of their photos in here. So these are two pockets. One is a um, thick white paper and the other one is a vellum pocket. And then these are ephemeras and this is a thick board sticker. And then um, I really wanted to show you this. But for their privacy, I, I created a, a heart-shaped um, collage for them in there and then I just put in all of the um, what are these the word sentiments ephemera I love how it actually transformed <clears throat> on this next divider um, our client requested that some of the interest of um, the, uh, the gift recipient would be incorporated and one of her interests is actually Harry Potter so we have um, a lot of Harry Potter stickers and um, it's actually available on our shop. What I did is I stripped those um, washi tapes on a paper. Not sure if I can show you a sample in here. I think I already 
put it somewhere. Anyway, so what I did is I stripped them on a paper and then um, I cut them, I punched them in circle shapes. So I hope you can see it. <coughs> Here you can see it's Quidditch and there the potion, the spiders, there. Slytherin, etc. So yeah, so there are like um, Harry Potter designs that are formal or serious and there are like cartoony and funky. And then here what I did was we have a washi tape that are houses and then I just layered it down here and I included the um, Hogwarts houses name. Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, Slytherin, right? So it's like the houses of Hogwarts. Okay. Um, Alright, so under the next page, this would be um, the extra papers that they have requested to be part of their scrapbook album so that they can continue to um, write their story. So, guys, I'll just take you to the next page. Alright, so next page it is. These are actually um, two heart-shaped collages. <laughs> And then, these are the extra pages. So, let me just flip it through for you. Um, hopefully, they would actually be able to use it for their designing. So, um, the recipient also wanted Disney as well as Harry Potter. So, I incorporated some Disney themed here at the bottom of the paper. And this, they actually love to eat and they love um, Japan. So you can, you will also see it in here on some of the papers. So here, tea, coffee, um, you know, breakfast, etc. And then this is a pocket. And this is the card that I've shown you earlier from the Heidi Swap collection. Okay. And here, another um, pocket. And the, this is a stamp, food stamp. It, it's a washi tape. Okay. And here it's another pocket. And then you can see in here, um, this is actually, I stamped the design in here. So this is the Lon Con Hearts. There. And this is the Heidi Swap stamp. Choose happy and looking good. This is a washi tape, a washi tape, and another washi tape. There. Here, it's another um, Heidi Swap uh, stamp collection. And a washi tape, a pet washi tape. That are cafe. There you go. And then, most of, oh, I forgot earlier, most of the no, not most. Actually, all of the stamps that I use are Distress Oxide. So, I use these colors. Victorian Velvet, Kitsch Flamingo. I also use um, this two. Stormy Sky and Broken China. So, it's a combination of blue and pinks. The ones that I used for um, stamping on these papers. There, this is broken china. Then these are pet washi tapes that I fuzzy cut. Another pet washi tapes and these hearts are actually stamps. There. And then these are all of the blank pages that they can utilize and you know design on their own. Um, they also love taking pictures, so I stamp this with camera. Another camera in here. I love how this color pops up against the pink. I think this is Broken China. And then some of the half sleeves in here with blank papers. I just put in some ephemera that they can use um, if they wanted to design it. And then this one, I made it in case he wanted to use this to in, um, put in his gift or letter. There. I put in a Velcro to seal it. And I put another bonus for them by incorporating this. 
So these are the washi tapes that has a theme of Disney and as well as Harry Potter. Okay, so I hope that they will like it and I hope you guys um, also enjoyed and you know get some ideas and tips on how you know you can actually design your own scrapbook album. So I also included um, pet stickers or pet washi tapes that I've already fuzzy cut um, for them to use. And then a few more of the tags and ephemera and as well, you know, stamps in here um, that are pre-cut so that they can further design some of the blank pages. I also incorporated this. I believe he might have um, a gift that, you know, he can use this. And then I know that the recipient um, has a daughter, so we included this for her little one. So this is the mini version of um, a scrapbook, a folder, a pocket folder with some, you know, already pre-cut papers that she can play with. There. Then another one in here. Pre-cut papers. And another one. There. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, if you have questions on the things that we did, if you have inquiries on, you know, where to find um, stuff or items, just send us a message and then we'll be happy to assist you guys. Alright? Thank you. Bye!